Welcome back, viewers, to Cube World Part 4. Last episode, you saw me get brutally slaughtered by three lizard people. They all ganged up on me, and that wizard was doing tornadoes on me, so it's not very fair. What about these guys? Are these guys good or bad? <gasps> these guys are good. Maybe I should keep with him. Oh, God. Do you think they'll notice if I just... Yep, they noticed. It's kind of like there's a group... And I'm the unwanted one. Look, the 10 round light. Leave us alone. Oh, I'll help you out, guys. Come on, 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 come on. Keep going. Oh, look, I'm almost dead. Leave me alone, bulls. God, they all got earned. There was four of them. Died twice already. Part four. Great. Oh, I'm about to die again. No, I'm not. I'm gonna whoop this guy's ass. Here he is. Here he is. Oh, here she is. I think that's a woman. Got lovely side parting hair. Oh, she got earned. She got earned. And I don't f regret killing her. It's not like I feel any guilt. She was, she was an evil, evil one. Don't worry about it, guys. I am ridding this cube world of evil with my great sword. I don't even know what this sword is called. Can I have a little look? Iron longsword, sorry. With my longsword. <laughs> I am depleting evil with my longsword. So what are we going to do today? I think we're going to have to kill some people because I am still level 1. And I think that's a little bit newbie. Four parts, level 1. Who cares? Insects. I don't know if I'm too far away though. Let's look at this little cucumber thing. Pick up this. Also, I need to... Oh, that's what I need to do. We need to find the closest water source so I can make some flasks. Are you serious? Is it all the way over there? Damn it. Damn it. Right, we're going to have to adventure on to this way today to go and make ourselves some potions. Hopefully. Right, okay. So you can't walk and open your bag at, at once. That's something to note. So I have three of these love hearts. I need to go buy some more. Not buy some more. Find some more. Because they, they grow on the floor. <laughs> I've got to buy some more because they grow on the floor. So I can make a load of health potions and it's going to be, I'm just going to be invincible then. I'm just going to be constantly drinking a health potion with one hand and just prodding them with my big thick iron sword. Scrub? Scrub! What did I get from this? Cobwebs. Don't know what I can do with cobwebs. Is it anything like cotton? Oh, only. Onion, onion link. Onion link. Okay. Let's kill this guy. There's a lot of noise over there. Right, don't see me, don't see me. Don't, I think those are the lizard people. I'm not 100% sure though. Goodbye, onion ring. Onion slice? I love onion slices. Maybe I can make some onion rings out of that. Oh, finally we got to water. Well, didn't take that long at all. So, let's make our way over here. Is there anything down here? Oh, mushrooms. What's that? Ginseng. What's a ginseng? Don't know, but it sounds pretty cool. Ginseng root. Okay. Is that a real thing, do you think? Because everything what I've found so far is, like, based off a real thing. I don't know if there is ginseng in the world. Maybe in Jap Japan? Because look at my guy, he looks, he looks a little bit anime. I think it's definitely inspired by a little bit of manga. Hey, mister! Oh, look, it's Dwarven friend. What's he got to say? I love camping. Well, come come over, baby. I've got a ca I've got a campsite. Uh, no, I don't. I can't even find a campsite, and I might need some. Right. So how do I do this? Do I go into equipment? I did buy them flasks, didn't I? If I did not buy them flasks, I was I was gonna go crazy then. Right. Oh, he's going in for a dip. Look at him. <laughs> have you ever seen a dwarf s swimming? Now you have. Now you have. That is amazing. That's a little strange. Look, there's water here, but it doesn't make me go down at all. It's just obviously too shallow. I was paddling a little. Right. Oh my god, look at my guy. Now, there's nothing better to be than a ninja. Look how ninja he looks. It looks real sneaky there. Do, 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 do. Oh, this is amazing. I'm going to love being a ninja. Right. What have we got? We've got 41 pumpkins. I am in the pumpkin business from now on. 
so there's some ginseng. Oh, maybe I should. Oh no, no. Let's fill up these flasks first. So right click, do I? No. Is it C for crafting system? It's most likely going to be this. And water flasks. Here we go. So we're just gonna fill up a load of these. Pick up that flower over there. Maybe a bit of ginseng because we'll make some gin, gin and tonic. We'll make my guy super strong, and you know he won't be able to feel pain because he's so drunk out of his mind. Come on, ginseng. I kind of like it because the candlelight sounds like Zen. Jin Zen. Okay. What is this guy? Is that the same guy? <laughs> does he just keep going? He's doing his daily laps. It's like my dad. My dad goes swimming and just does laps. Like that. Old, old little man. No, my dad isn't an old little man. He's a warrior. He's a dwarf. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's the same guy. It's like, I love camping. Well, come over here, baby. There's a campsite. Rest your little head in there. No. No, nope, he's not having any of it. So what do we do? We press C, and I believe that it was potions. Here we go. Oh, great. So I can make four. And I guess I can just make them on the road whenever I find... Oh, speaking of the heart flowers, let's pick up one of these. Let's make another one. That I love that fact that you just press F and you get out your light. And it just makes a difference, even at daytime. It's a, an amazing little touch right there. Right, what am I doing? Making one of these. Got it. Right. Dwarf. Dwarf. Where have you gone? Again. I'm telling you, he loves the water. That was the dwarf one, right? Yeah, it's just it's just laid there. <laughs> I'm not sure if he's meant to be doing that or he's a little bit bugged. He he's a I'll just what's going on man? I love how you flirt. It must be his big chubby belly just makes him flirt. You know Gilly's games? He can't, he can't swim underwater, he just floats. As, as kids, I, I tried to teach him how to swim underwater. Didn't help. He's, he's too buoyant. He's like a boat. You, you could put a motor on Ashley, Gilly, brackets, Gilly's games, and just, just ride him. Ride him across the ocean. Ladies? Okay. What's that over there? I don't know. May I, I think I'm in a little bit too of a difficult area over here. So maybe we should go a little bit closer to the city. Oh, ginseng. Hopefully there's something useful because I've got so many ginseng now. Ginseng. I'm just going to call it gin. 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 Right. Let's pick up some mushrooms. Hopefully I can make some mushroom soup. Hate it in real life. Love it in games. It just, you know, it fills up your character. Right, I'm gonna have to kill this cat, guys. I'm going to have to kill this cat. So it is right. You can kill anything outside of the city, I think. What what isn't like an ally. Because if this cat was inside the city, hopefully he isn't part of the uh, the mafia group. Because then I'm gonna be in big big trouble. Come on, Zen, you're meant to be leveling up. Oh well, at least I made some potions. That's one objective completed. Right. What are we doing? Oh, there's bugs over there. Let's go kill some flies. Because flies are disgusting. They just, you know, they, they keep around poop all day. And then they just come and fly over you. Right. What's that over there? It's like a flamingo. Come on, mister. Can't be distracted by flamingos when I'm slaughtering flies. Oh, these guys can actually fly. <laughs> Hence the name. 3 XP, not bad, not bad. <gasps> can I make, can I make more? Yes. Right, and I need to, can I, there we go. Wait, no, no, have I bugged it out? Oh, no, no, thank God. Oh, I'm typing, I'm typing. Whoa, wa ba was. So is it enter? Hello. Mr. Bird. <laughs> I don't know what he is. <laughs> oh, it's a peacock. Cock. Cock. Okay. So... What am I doing? <laughs> I'm scared of him. That's what I'm doing. So I've made enough potions. What I was going to do is switch out my Q menu for my potions. So I just press Q. There we go. Let's take this guy down. Let's just have a quick heal up, because I don't know if he's going to one-shot me. He's orange, so he shouldn't be that bad. And he's actually neutral until I start stabbing him and poking him with my big sword. 
Oh, I am actually quite good, aren't I, guys? Thank you, thank you. Did anyone see my... Oh, I thought I killed him. <laughs> He's coming back to life. I noticed a strength meter and on the uh, just above my health and mana points. I'm not exactly sure what that means. Is it the more I fight, the stronger I get? If I keep comboing up? Probably. Hello, wizards. You guys look awesome. I think these are elves, but in hoods, because look at the little ears. What's that? Pan Patney. Patney. I'm just going to call you Pat and Panty. Panty <laughs> Missander. <laughs> Panty Misunderstander. Okay. You guys want to group up with me? We'll have a little... I've got some potions. We can drink them over here. I've got some gin in here if you want it. No? Just going to have a little sit down here. Oh, you can actually sit! Well, thanks for watching. Like, if you love me, subscribe to support me. Check out all my links down below. Leave a comment about the video. And I will see you guys in part five. Thank you so much for watching. Leave a comment if I did anything wrong. Anything wrong. Just say, Zen, you're an idiot. You walked past this. You didn't kill this. And you didn't make this in the crafting menu. Peace out.